Imagine a world where the mysteries of the universe lay just beyond the horizon, where ancient wisdom and celestial wonders were intertwined with everyday life. This was the world of Enoch, a time when the divine seemed just a whisper away, and the stories of the heavens influenced every aspect of human existence. In this realm of untold mysteries, one man embarked on a journey that would reveal the secrets of creation itself. A man of unparalleled curiosity and faith ventured into the unknown, seeking answers to the questions that have puzzled humanity since the dawn of time. Join us as we step through the veil of history into Enoch's world, where angels tread and the fabric of reality is woven with dreams and visions. In the annals of ancient lore and the lineage of humanity, there stands a figure of unparalleled mystery and divine favor, Enoch, the seventh from Adam. Distinguished not by his reign or battles won, but by his profound spiritual journey and communion with the divine, Enoch's life, as chronicled in ancient texts, was marked by righteousness, wisdom, and a closeness with God that few could fathom. Unlike his forebears and successors, Enoch's earthly journey concluded in a manner most extraordinary. It is said, he walked with God and he was not, for God took him, as stated in Genesis 5.24, a testament to his purity and divine favor. This mystical departure has ignited imaginations and scholarly debates for millennia, painting Enoch as a bridge between the mortal and the divine, a messenger who traversed the ethereal divide. In the 18th century, the Book of Enoch, an ancient text filled with visions, prophecies, and heavenly journeys, emerged from centuries of mystery, thanks to the remarkable journey of James Bruce. As an explorer driven by an insatiable curiosity for hidden knowledge in distant lands, Bruce traveled to Ethiopia, where he encountered and brought back to Europe copies of this ancient work, preserved for centuries within the sacred confines of the Ethiopian Orthodox Church. The book, written in Gaea's language, an ancient Semitic language of Ethiopia, is a compilation of several sections, each detailing aspects of the heavenly realms, angelic hierarchies, and the fate of souls. Its origins, shrouded in the mists of time, are believed to date back to the Second Temple period, a time when Jewish mystical thought and apocalyptic literature thrived, sparking debates and offering a closer look at humanity's search for divine connection in a world filled with angels. In the heart of the Second Temple period, a time of tumultuous change and fervent religious expression, the Book of Enoch emerges as a beacon of mystical thought and apocalyptic fervor. This era, marked by the rebuilding of the Temple in Jerusalem and the flowering of Jewish religious life, provided fertile ground for the growth of apocalyptic literature, of which the Book of Enoch is a paramount example. Enoch's journey, as detailed in the text, transcends the mere physical offering a bridge to the heavenly realms through visions and revelations. Enoch's descriptions of angelic hierarchies, the mechanics of the universe, and the ultimate fate of souls paint a vivid picture of the world beyond our sight, informed by the theological and cosmological debates of his era. Through his eyes, we are invited to explore the mysteries of creation, the dynamics of heavenly justice, and the path to divine wisdom, in the narratives of the Book of Enoch about his dreams and visions, few tales are as profound and troubling as that of the Watchers where he encountered angelic beings, sent to oversee the earth, but were succumbed to the allure of mortal life, and they started to forget their true purpose, leading to their ultimate downfall. The text recounts their descent, driven by desire and curiosity. They taught humans things that were meant to be secret, how to make weapons, the art of beauty and forbidden knowledge that humans weren't ready to handle that irrevocably altered the course of human history. The situation got even more complicated when the Watchers had children with human women. These children were the Nephilim, giant beings with incredible strength and a hunger that could never be satisfied. Their presence caused chaos and violence, disturbing the balance of the world. Enoch, as a mediator, pronounced a decree that sealed the fate of the Watchers and their progeny, revealing their eternal imprisonment for disrupting heavenly order. In his visions found in the book lies a series of profound prophecies that foretell the coming judgment and the eventual redemption of the world. Among these revelations, the figure of the Son of Man emerges as a central pillar, a messianic presence destined to bring justice and restore harmony to creation. Enoch's visions unfold as a cosmic drama where heavenly courts convene to judge the wicked, both angelic and human. 
The imagery is stark, portraying a world teetering on the brink of divine wrath, yet always with a thread of hope woven through the darkness. The Son of Man, described with authority to judge and kingship to rule, stands as a beacon of light, promising a future where righteousness prevails and peace is restored. Enoch's prophecies embody core apocalyptic themes, revealing consequences of corruption and rebellion, divine mercy, triumph of good over evil, and offering a timeless message of hope and renewal that resonates through the ages. Within the pages of the astronomical book, Enoch embarks on an extraordinary celestial journey, guided by angels to uncover the secrets of the heavens. His detailed observations of the sun, moon, and stars reflect an advanced understanding of celestial cycles, serving not just as scientific inquiry, but as a testament to the divine order that governs the cosmos. Enoch's descriptions offer a glimpse into the ancient world's view of astronomy, intertwined with sacred meaning and purpose. Transitioning from the celestial to the visionary, Enoch's dream visions present a metaphorical history of the world, from its creation to the final judgment. Through vivid dreams, Enoch sees the fate of the righteous and the wicked, the rise and fall of kingdoms, and the eventual renewal of the earth. These dreams, laden with symbolism, speak to the cyclical nature of history, where human actions and divine will are in constant interplay. In the concluding sections of his writings, Enoch addresses future generations through a series of letters, known collectively as the Epistle of Enoch. Within these letters, he distills the essence of his spiritual journey and the heavenly revelations bestowed upon him, offering guidance and wisdom for righteous living. Enoch's message transcends the bounds of time, speaking directly to the heart of humanity's eternal struggle between virtue and vice. The epistle is rich with ethical teachings, exhorting readers to walk in paths of righteousness, to uphold justice, and to be steadfast in the face of moral decay. Enoch warns of the dire consequences awaiting those who choose wickedness, painting a vivid picture of divine judgment that awaits the corrupt and the unrighteous. Yet his words also carry a promise of hope and redemption for those who turn towards the light, embodying the principles of compassion, integrity and faith. The journey of the Book of Enoch from revered scripture to apocryphal text is a fascinating study in the evolution of religious belief and scriptural authority. Despite its early influence on Jewish and Christian thought, the Book of Enoch found itself on the margins of the biblical canon, a decision that reflects the complex interplay of theology, tradition, and history. The reasons for its exclusion are diverse. Scholars and religious authorities debated the text's authenticity, its authorship, and its compatibility with established doctrines. The Book of Enoch's expansive narratives on angels, the cosmos, and divine judgment, while compelling, diverged significantly from the prevailing theological perspectives of the time. Additionally, its origin in the intertestamental period, a time not directly represented by the apostolic writings, further complicated its canonical status. Yet, the exclusion of the Book of Enoch from the canonical Bible did not diminish its impact. Its themes and motifs continue to resonate within the broader tapestry of religious literature, influencing the development of apocalyptic and mystical traditions. The decision to place it beyond the canonical boundary speaks to the dynamic nature of religious texts and the ongoing dialogue between faith, tradition, and the quest for spiritual understanding. The Book of Enoch, once on the biblical canon's fringes, holds a lasting influence on religious and cultural history. Its themes of divine judgment, celestial hierarchies, and cosmic order resonate in Judaism, Christianity, and Islam, shaping apocalyptic and mystical thought for ages. Beyond scripture, Enoch's visions inspire artists, writers, and theologians, fueling imaginations with angelic rebellion, prophetic dreams, and celestial mechanics. Its rich tapestry fuels creative and spiritual quests. In its revelation about creation's secrets, the book unveils not only angelic tales, but also cosmic origins and governing principles. It bridges the gap between the seen and unseen, the scientific and the divine, revealing profound cosmic insights. His insights into the workings of the world, from the movements of the heavenly bodies to the foundation of the earth, reflect a deep contemplation of creation's mysteries. These revelations, though couched in the language and symbolism of ancient thought, resonate with contemporary questions about the nature of the universe and our place within it. 
Enoch's perspective offers a unique confluence of mythology, theology, and cosmology, inviting us to consider the interconnectedness of all things, the complexity of existence, and the profound wonder that underpins the cosmos. The stories of Enoch, with their rich tapestry of wisdom and wonder, remind us that the world is full of mysteries waiting to be explored. From the depths of the oceans to the farthest reaches of the cosmos, from ancient texts to modern discoveries, there's so much more to learn, to question and to marvel at. Enoch's journey, from earthly patriarch to celestial sage, challenges us to look beyond the material and to contemplate the mysteries that lie beyond the reach of ordinary perception. In sharing his visions, the Book of Enoch invites us into a conversation that spans millennia, encouraging us to seek understanding, wisdom, and a deeper connection with the divine. So if you've enjoyed this journey through the ancient world of Enoch, and are curious about what other mysteries lie hidden in the shadows of history, make sure to subscribe to our channel. Tap the bell icon to get notified about our latest expeditions into the unknown, because there's always another mystery around the corner, waiting to be uncovered.